All right, good morning. My name is Colin Zamadi. Um, we set up snail farms for prospective clients here in Nigeria. Um, this farm is, um, is in Jericho. Um, so what we do is we set up a free range cutting method system. That's what that's the system we do uh, right here. Um, so far, it has proven to be a very good system for us. Uh, this is Jericho in Abokuta. I want to show you um, at Ibadan. I uh, mean to say, I want to show you um, show you around the farm, so you can see this farm is actually set out. You can see the farm. This this comprises of about three farms. One, two, three. There. Uh, this is a, a total of a 2,400 square meters um, size of farm. So we decided to split it into three, uh, so it can contain. Don't forget, your farms. There are three uses of your farm. Your farms can serve as um, a partner where you get snails from the wide, you can see it's raining right now, you get snails from the wide, you put into your farm, and then uh, during dry season, you sell off uh, uh, at, a high pr at a higher price. Um, it's also, it also can serve as a breeder, where you get snails, let them stay inside, uh, uh, breed, and then uh, the babies hatch, and then grow, and then sell your babies off. And then it also serves as a storage system where you can store your snails. Now, in whatever you do among these three uses of this greenhouse, uh, just know that one of them is assured, breeding is assured. Snails don't stay in one place. Once they stay in one place, they lay eggs. They keep breeding. So both as a storage and as um, uh, a partner, they all do the same purpose. So let me take you around this farm. Each of these farms is 70 feet like this uh, by 50 feet like this. Come inside. Right, this is a freshly constructed farm. You can see um, the way it is. Um, nicely constructed with the shade, uh, with the, uh, uh, um, the, uh, the nets that we use as the shades. All made all, uh, this is a greenhouse made of gov uh, governized sheets, uh, governized iron pipes. Um, this at least will give us about 50 years lifespan in this place. You can see the, the, this is a um, uh, the uh, internal uh, snail fields with the cutting method systems. This is governance sheet. The purpose of this is to ensure that um, uh, reptiles and crawling animals don't come in. Snakes can climb this, lizards can climb this. And uh, we at least go uh, uh, about a foot deep into this ground to make sure that um, even traveling and, uh, uh, rodents don't come into these places. You can see our sprinklers, they are all from up. Uh, uh, when we put on the sprinkler from the control, which is right at that end, all the sprinklers come on. This is good looking work fast. This sprinkler controls this section. You can see this section of these sprinklers, uh, this controls takes care of this. Uh, this other control takes care of this. Uh, that other one, the remaining two at that other end. So you can see all those other all those, all those, all those, all those yeah. ones. This is a freshly constructed farm and like I said you can always reach us on 080-731-22596 or you send us a mail on afrocatalyst at gmail.com don't forget, there are basic things that you need to have in your farm before you come in. You should have land, um, have a form of security. You can see how fenced this place is. Have a farmhouse. You can see one right at that side. I will show you on our way out. And then have a tank stand. That's a tank stand. I will go outside now and show you. You should have a tank stand with tank on top. These are the basics. Then we will come in. We will work in any part of the country. We will come in and then we will set up the greenhouse proper for you. This is the farmhouse that they are setting up. This is not part of our own job, but it's basic. Uh, it's part of the basic things you should have to, uh, for your farm because whoever is managing your farm will have to be living there. Snails are nocturnal animals, and they are more active at night and not during the day.
general function uh, is this, which they're supposed to have to. Uh, you can see what we do too. We also cast them by the side too to ensure that the base of the uh, of the uh, UK sheet material is well grounded. Um, after we leave, it's if you can, it's good if you can do a gutter around the whole farm. That's an extra service. If you can do that, you are protecting your farm. This is how your farm should look like. From here, we run our irrigation system into the farm. This is the second farm. The same system replicated on this place too. The same 70 by 50 feet. This is it. Let's go to the test. because of the size of the farm. One tank stand might not be able to serve the whole three farms. You can see that we have to do the second, uh, second tank stand right over here. We also, uh, we've also done soil treatment on this soil. Um, uh, you can use any of the chemicals that con contain the pyro force. I will leave the third one then. Right, you can see. Um, our plan actually is to use the first one and the second one um, as both storage, breeding, and um, fattening system, and then as they're laying eggs and their babies are hatching, we we'll bring them to this third compartment. Uh, and all this whole thing can be done in one farm, but if you have the capacity, you can go on this kind of level, and that will help contain your snails properly. Don't forget to reach me on 080-731-22596 or send me a mail on afrocatalyst at gmail.com. Uh, you can also you, you can also set up, set up your farm yourself if it feels you don't want us to um, to do that. You can send me a message too on WhatsApp on that same number. Um, and then you can also get your snail feed from us. You can supply your snail feed in any part of the world, in any part of this country. The, the, the feed that your Ashatinas needs to grow to maximum size. Um, don't also forget, uh, snail farming is something that is emerging. We're all learning in this business, but we feel we've gotten to a comfortable level where we feel at this stage we can go commercial. Uh, the snails are doing well in most of our farms and they're improving properly. This is a prototype. Uh, this is a um, um, updating you on um, on this size of farm. This is close to one acre, not up to an acre, but close to one acre. Um, you can you can um, uh, reach us, and then um, these are the services we render to. We do farm setup. You get your farm manager. We train the farm manager while we're setting up, and then uh, we leave the place. Uh, we consult for you um, from our office, and uh, we tell you uh, things you need to do call every week and then we also um, try to find out um, uh, the issues, the, uh, the challenges you are facing for the next one year. Um, also, um, we'll be ready to offtake your snails when you start um, harvesting your snails. We are both at the beginning and at the ending, uh, uh, but you just come in and then rear your snails. And then um, um, the beginning and the ending is our responsibility. We we'll take snails, we we'll buy them from you once you start harvesting any quantity. We are here. My name is Colin Zamadi, right from Jericho, Ibadan. Thank you.